Holy bazongas, look at all of that cold steel. Holy crap, this is my cold steel collection video. And I've got way more than I thought. And they all look very similar. It's kind of weird seeing them all stacked up in a pile like this. Just a ton of black G10 and grivery and bead blasted or stone washed handles. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> let's run through these real quick. We'll just take a look at them just for fun. Because uh, I enjoy going through my, my knives and uh, kind of looking at them. Here we have the large Espada. What a fun beast of a knife. Fun and yet functional kind of in certain circumstances. I mean, if you need something this large. What I mean is it's not a novelty large. Um, you may consider it novelty because of its size, but it's a functional knife. You know, it's razor sharp, rock solid, usable if you needed a folding knife this large, which, you know, I'm sure a lot of you don't, but still a cool knife to have. Cool design, a lot of fun. Nice G10. Really like this one. Carried it one day, a little too big for me, but uh, still fun to have. Spartan. This is a Cold Steel Classic right here, probably one of the best values in terms of big, overbuilt, beefy knives that's currently on the market, production market. Very cool. Love that look, very Demko-y. A lot of his uh, telltale, telltale signs on here that says, Andrew Demko designed this knife. Really cool. Then we've got a Recon 1. This is the drop point with serrations. Cool knife. Lightweight, rock solid, ugly black coating. But uh, if what you're looking for is just a good solid knife you can use for not a ton of money. Definitely a good knife. Black coating will prevent rust too. Raja 3. Very Demko y as well. Grivery handle. I've kind of put a little bit of a satin finish on this guy. Not, uh, I didn't overdo it a ton, but uh, it doesn't have the uh, standard bead blast that uh, it came with. Very cool. Easy to flick open if I had more room. Counterpoint one. A little bit of a cheesy knife, but still pretty cool. This one probably has the easiest to open access lock out of all of my cold steels. I think they're doing a XL version of this this year, so that's pretty cool. I don't think I'll get it, but still pretty cool. Nice dagger, folder, triad lock, of course. Here is an XL Tonto. <laughs> what a cool knife. I mean, it just makes me smile. Regardless of how you feel about cold steel or if this is practical or not, it makes me smile when I open this thing up. It's just kind of cool. So that's why I have it. Another XL, the Vaquero. What a wicked blade shape right there. This thing is gnarly. Here is another Recon 1 that has been acid washed and stone washed. G10 handles, acid washed, stone washed clip. All the bells and whistles, or all the bells and whistles. Everything's acid washed and stone washed. Same with this uh, American Lawman, which is basically a production 8010. Andrew Demko's 8010. Real nice knife. Uh, normally comes with the black coating as well, but uh, I've taken that off and done the stone washing on it. Pretty cool. I've carried this one quite a bit. This is the counterpoint, or holdout, sorry. Holdout something. I think two or three. I think it's the medium sized one, four inch blade. I did some cool, or at least I think it's cool, some cool tests on this baby. It is tough. I hammered it through a 2x4, chopped through some stuff. I mean, it's it's pretty impressive. And it's also a nice, kind of sleek carry. Comes with a uh, satin finish, but I did a stone wash on it. So pretty cool. I like that one. And then a large Voyager Vaquero. Man, this large size, just a good all-around inexpensive utility EDC blade. I've said it before, you know, if I only had 40 bucks on a knife, it would probably be one of these. Or at least it would be in the rotation. 
I don't know about the Vaquero blade, but it'd be a large Voyager. All right, guys, so that's it. That is all of my cold steels that I currently have. Um, here's the two larges. Yeah, I definitely, I, I like it. I like cold steel. It's fun. Fun company. All right, guys, take it easy. Just wanted to show those off. Feel free to do a video response showing yours. All right, guys, take it easy.